Hey guys, this is Commander Michael, and I'm bringing you a Battlefield 3 multiplayer commentary. I believe this is Conquest Large on... Hmm, what, what map was it? I think, it, yeah, CN Crossing. And, um, I'm just doing a voiceover for this because my computer fan is annoying, and I don't like it in the way. But, anyways. <laughs> um... I think I'm only going to be using the support class in this, um, in this record, I mean, in this gameplay, yeah, yeah, only the support class, um, and it's pretty, it's pretty good, especially the M249, with all the attachments I have on it, I've, I enjoy it thoroughly, for, for the, yeah, <laughs> I, I enjoy it very much, and I have a very high quality mic, and I, I would just, I like it so much better without the computer fan being there, but my computer, being a supercomputer, has like this humongous fan, it's like, Wah! and I, I, I'm gonna have to look around for something that doesn't make that sound, but until then, I'll have to do voiceovers, if it's not live comms on purpose, and when it is live comms, you guys just gonna have to live with that, till then, I guess, yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Um, moving on, moving on, uh, you'll guys see me use the mortars a little bit, I just unlocked that actually, because I, I haven't been playing the support class a lot, but I just did unlock that, and, and I absolutely hate mortars, I hate being killed by it, let's say, it. yeah, that's better, I hate being killed by it, I love using it, but I hate being killed by it, it's one of those things, it's one of those things, it's actually pretty much like every weapon in the whole freaking game. Um, but yeah, yeah, I love using it, but I hate being killed by it, and that is a major problem for me, getting killed by it. It's very, very disappointing for me, but yeah, you guys will see me. I don't actually have the video up with me right now, because I'm on my laptop, and the main video file is on my computer, and then I'll be putting this sound file onto the computer via flash drive, so yeah. But um, I, I don't have the video file up right now, so I can't actually talk about anything that's going on. But you'll see a, a few cheap deaths in there, and a few cheap kills in there as well. The infrared is beautiful. It's the best thing in the whole freaking world. I could, like, use infrared on every weapon all day long. I'd just be happy. It'd be like, in, it'd be like weapon heaven for me. Battlefield heaven. The infrared is very powerful in seeing and crossing, and I'm not the only one who've said that before. A lot of people think that it's very, very powerful and useful in seeing and crossing. And it's actually useful on every map, I'm finding. It's it's fun. It's fun to use. It's it's and and it's and it just helps you in a lot of ways. The disappointing thing is you have to get a hundred kills with the weapon. But if you if you like the weapon, it, it isn't that hard. You can snatch it up in a day. And um Yeah. I just, I, I love the infrared. Um, my first impressions of the mortars, they seem weaker for me than they are for whenever I get killed by it. But I guess those people, like, whenever I get killed by it, these people have, like, guided mortar, like, attachments, and I'm like, what? So, they have, like, some freaking, like, guided mortars. They can, like, there's a camera on the mortar, I guess. I don't know how it works like that. I, I mean, I, I might want to look it up sometime. Um, actually, speaking of, I could, I could look it up right now. That'd be pretty easy for me. I'll look it up right now. Um, <clears> hmm, <throat> hmm, oh, uh, okay, Google Chrome, open. And you guys can just watch the commentary and enjoy me dying a lot. It gets better, actually, by the end. It's, it's a lot better by the end. I think. Nah, <laughs> I, I mean, I just played it, so, um, WWW No, 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 no. Actually, um, yes, YouTube. Please, take me to YouTube. Yes. Thank you, Google Chrome. Oh, by the way, get Adblock Plus Pro for Google Chrome or Firefox if you haven't. It's amazing. Um, once you get it, get, like, subscribe to, um, the Easy List English filters and it'll block all the ads ever in the world. It's Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Battlefield. It's kind of hard because the mic is like right in front of the keyboard, so I have to like reach around it. Battlefield free. 
Um, mortar. Mortar. Mortar, mortar. Mortar. No, I'm not looking for just mortars. I'm looking for guided mortars. Is that it? I, I don't know. No, no, no. I'm looking for something better than this. Um, battlefield. Well, you guys can just watch and I'll try to type it in. Speaking of, um, so yeah, the motors, first impressions, I don't, I don't like it. <laughs> I mean, it's, 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 it's good. It's good. I've got it. I get a few kills with it in, in the game. We'll see. But, um, definitely don't like just in general. Um, uh, mortar with attachments. Actually, okay. actually, yeah, okay, so, I'm just gonna see if I can find a, yeah, um, I think this guy is using attachments, he is, oh, yeah, I think he is. Oh wow. I, I think he's using attachments of some sort. I think he zoomed out and I'm pretty sure I, didn't, I don't think you could zoom out. Actually, I, I'm trying to look around for it. But anyways, po whole point is... Um, is that there's that you can get attachments for it and it can be very cheap sometimes and it's very useful if your um, team is actually spawning but like spawning enemies then it's useful um, but yeah <laughs> wow I'm just watching this guy, and I think he just... I can't be... F I don't know for sure, but I think he just, um... Yeah, yeah, this guy's just using the mortars the whole game. Um, I believe so. Pretty cheap of him, but... But I guess pros will be pros. Yeah? Okay. Get back to talking about this. So you guys will see me jumping around with the mortars and using that M249. Um, next unlock beside was from the M249, at least. Um, oh, and I've gotten the M249 and mortars and stuff. I believe I'm getting the PKP Bushenenig. Bushenenig. I don't know what it is, but um, I've been killed by it. It's a one-shot kill button, and I've looked at gameplays of it. People absolutely own it, so. Once I get that, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna just dance around with it for a little while, killing everyone. Cause I mean, <laughs> yeah. Use your ammo. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, the PKP is the one that just owns everything um like it's a one-shot kill thing i don't know i think it's a hundred ammo and it's pretty slow firing but it, it's a one-shot kill and <laughs> battlefield even battlefield 3 one-shot kill counts a lot <laughs> it's very good if you can get a one-shot kill but um anyways yeah you'll see me running around and seeing crossing personally i like it it's a good map and I like it better than a lot of the other starter maps that have come with Battlefield 3. Definitely will be getting all the DLCs. Um, so, if you guys continue watching, you'll see me playing those DLCs, because, yeah, that's how cool DLCs are. Um, no, but I mean, uh, definitely back to Carcan will be exciting. I, I will be really, really happy to start playing those BF2 maps again. 
Um, jeez, BF2 maps bring bring back good memories or whatever. Um, <laughs> uh, it will be definitely great to see those um old old maps back and in Battlefield 3, you know, Battlefield 3 quality. I think it's very nice that they decided to do something like that. Um, speaking of being nice, Modern Warfare 3, I, I just, this game, this is like the first time I've ever not heard people so over Modern Warfare 3. I mean, I'm hearing people, like, even on Facebook, like, my friends are just like, I unlocked the gold on this, I feel so special. I'm like, Battlefield, cheers. And then they're like, I've got Battlefield, but it's on my console, and so glitchy and weird, and, and I can't get many kills with it. I'm like, yeah, because in Battlefield, you gotta start using the weapons to get kills with them. Because then you unlock attachments. They're like, attachments? What? So that so the stuff that the ghost guy's been wearing, they got that because they were shooting people? And I'm like, yeah. Uh, and then they're like, oh my god, I didn't know that. I mean, yeah, I mean, it, that's pretty much it. That's that's all that it is. <laughs> I mean, it, it, it's like, wow, you guys need to play Battlefield 3 more. <laughs> you guys need to stop playing that Modern Warfare 3 because it's the shittiest game out there. I mean, Call of Duty is at least. But I did hear that they did change quite a few things in Modern Warfare 3 besides engine and engine. <laughs> I mean, the, besides the engine and the engine, the thing that it doesn't matter, because gra- like I told you bef I, I think I've told you before, graphics don't make a game, quality makes a game, and, and so, you'll, you've probably heard me say that before, that's what I meant by it, quality makes a game, and, and personally, not graphics, so, as long as the game's good, but there's a difference between having bad graphics but it being a good game but having graphics that are exact same for about six years straight and games being the exact same for six years straight so i'm glad they changed a few elements in multiplayer a lot of it is the same though and it's just very very disappointing that they haven't changed the engine and not even graphics wise but like the engine like how it you know um how it how it like how multiplayer like different types of multiplayer and you know the icons you see that's what i'm talking about as well that's included and it's just a big 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 disappointment but anyways um so battlefield 3 first impressions of multiplayer and the mortars i guess i've been playing multiplayer for a while now but yeah it's a great game great game beautiful awesome great if you haven't got it i don't know what's wrong with you go get that game it is, it is beautiful and awesome. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this commentary. I believe the video is ending up soon. It's ending at 1347, which is pretty cool. And yeah, more Battlefield 3 commentaries and live comms and stuff like that will be coming up. This one's a voiceover, but whatever. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Adios.